customer at the Masonic Temple in downtown Detroit. We're here for a roller derby bout. Uh, we play in the drill hall. It's just a big open wooded floor. We have our track set down. We have seating for 600 people. Our capacity is 8 or 850. So we've sold out the last three bouts, including tonight. This organization started back a few years ago. Detroit decided we wanted to start a league, so a couple girls got together. They started the league. Eventually, they got enough girls that we were able to split into four home teams, and a different group of girls makes up the all-star team, which is Detroit's travel team. So we just go by Detroit Derby Girls for that. Well, she's hot, So when the whistle goes, the pack takes off, they start to skate, there might be some hitting, some bumping around, pretty much your general torso is the contact zone. The objective is to help your jammer and stop the other jammer from getting through the pack and you know push them into other teammates or whatever you have to do. So simultaneously you're always playing um, offense and defense. The friendships that you create instantaneously are amazing. I mean, it's really cool to have, be able to call 60 different people. I need a favor, I need, I need a plumber, I need my furnace is broken, my, you know, like, I need a deck built, just anything. I just need a ride somewhere. It's just, it's really a really cool dynamic group of people and they really are like your family. So that's probably the best part of it. Ride, ride. Come on, people now. It's a very intense, Competitive sport and everything is real. I mean, you see people falling over the place. There is real injuries, but at the same time, it's just a really cool sport. It's not so aggressive that people can't bring their children. It's just a really cool, different thing to do. And I think it tends to bring women in that either have never participated in a sport or that have been out of sports for quite some time in high school or college. And it just really brings, brings people together. I just think it's important to have something for women to do. It's fairly cheap, it's not too far. I mean, it's right here in downtown Detroit, so it's not too far off the map for people that come down for events. It brings something to Detroit, it's just different. You know, and Detroit's a, obviously a very unique place. And I'm pretty sure that you're gonna wanna come back if you come. She's a box and a box.